Centrifugation is often performed before filtration. It is used when we need to quickly settle solid particles from the suspension and separate them from the liquid. Centrifugation is based on rotation around a single axis at high speed, which creates a rotational force that goes in the direction of a circle. The centrifugal force causes the solid, heavier part of the sample to accumulate at the bottom of the tube. In our laboratory we have two different centrifuges with different rotors and holders. For larger tubes and larger sample volumes, we use a centrifuge with six positions. For smaller tubes and smaller sample volumes, we use a centrifuge with 32 positions. The two instruments also differ in their maximum rotational speed. Switch on the centrifuge using the switch button at the back of the machine. Wait until open appears on the display and then open the centrifuge cap using the red stop open button. Insert your samples suspended in the liquid medium and placed in the centrifuge tubes with tightly closed lids into the rotor holder. The holder does not need to be completely filled but must be laterally balanced. Always load samples symmetrically with an even number of tubes. If you have an odd number of samples, add a tube filled with water of the appropriate weight. If there is an unbalanced weight or an unbalanced number of tubes, the display will show the imbalance error message and the system will prevent the centrifuge from starting. Gently close the centrifuge cap until you hear the automatic closing sound. The centrifugation parameters are set by pressing the select button. Press it repeatedly to scroll through the entire menu. The value of the selected parameter is set with the rotary wheel and confirmed by pressing the start impulse button. The OK message appears on the display. Proceed in the same way to set the other parameters. Centrifuge settings vary according to sample type matrix density and centrifuge tube type. 50 milliliter tubes can handle a maximum speed of 5,000 rotations per minute. 15 milliliter tubes can be centrifuged at up to 9,000 rotations per minute. The typical setting for soil extraction in a 50 milliliter centrifuge tube is 5,000 rotations per minute and a duration of 10 minutes. Centrifugation is finished with a complete rotor stop and an audio signal. You can now open the centrifuge cap and carefully remove the samples. Avoid moving quickly or shaking the samples. Always make sure that the tubes have not been damaged and that the inside of the centrifuge remains clean.